It's Amy Squad back at again with another video here today, man. We got King of the Packs episode 17 in the building, and man, I feel like every single pack this week had a big banger pull in it. So excited to show you guys the pulls. You guys don't know what King of the Packs is, where I rank every coin and training pack in Madden 23. Every time I put a pack onto the tier list, I'm gonna show some of you guys' big banger pulls that you guys submitted to me on Twitter. Post looks like this: open Friday through Tuesday. Um, I have a little bit of rules that go with it. Make sure you guys are posting your pictures underneath the name in the comment section. I'll have an example of that. Whoever has the most submissions at the end of the year will get the Madden 24 Big Banger Edition on your boy. Um, but yeah, there was a lot of good submissions this week. We have maybe some new packs coming with ghost cards. I'm not really sure if they'll upgrade zero chill packs, but this is what we have for this week. So before we do get into it, you know what I have to say. Say in every video, make sure you guys hit the like button right now. Hit the sub button if you haven't, man, because a lot of y'all watch the videos and haven't hit the sub button. I mean, what the heck are you doing, bro? Hit that sub button. Also put on post notifications, man. Join the Nodi gang. Let it the comment section and let me know down below what is your king pack. That is your go-to pack, your favorite pack in the game. The pack that, you know, you're doing the best with. So, um, we'll start in the middle. Game days. Not in the game right now, so we can't really rank those. Don't have any submissions for it. Strategies. I'm going to put in do not pull anymore. You guys know I love the strategy pack when the TVP is not in the game because a lot of the strategy cards do go for a lot when the TVP is gone. Um, once the TVP is left, that pack will move up a little bit. AK is not in the game anymore. I think that gets rid of everything we needed to get rid of. I think every other pack has a submission. Um, we'll go with get a gold. Now, I feel like this is kind of a sleeper pack right now. I don't open it, but I see a lot of people getting crazy pulls from it. I'm going to put it at the top of the garbage can just because I don't have experience with it. You guys know every time I open Get It Golds, I feel like the pack opening takes way too long. It's boring. It's all gold cards. Maybe I'll give it another shot. I don't really know. We will see what happens this week, but let's get into the big banger submissions for the Get It Gold pack. I was not joking. We got big banger submissions this week, bro. We had Real Jason Guzman and Clap for Your Mans. I'll give you a clap, bro. 95 zero chill masters for both of you guys out of the get a goal i mean these are like 450 500k pulls right here from a get a gold player pack bro insane and it's like the gold plus i think this is like the 70 plus too so you guys just snap bro ggt all man real jason guzman and clap for your mans maybe the get a golds are it you guys are king of the get a gold player pack for the week and episode let's keep on moving all right next pack let's just get the team of the week out of here bro i literally just before this video i ripped 10 team of the week packs because i was going for gifts and i was like you know what let me try the team of the week so we got brand new team of the weeks in the game today let's test it out i literally did not pull above an 86 i i just don't know what to say about this pack bro i did not pull above an 86 for the new guys or any of that it's just it's horrible like this pack is so bad i'm glad i didn't open it on a video because i'd have just been roasting it but you guys did get some good pulls so let's go check it out well, I guess Chris got some good pulls here, man. 95 Baker Mayfield with the Andre Reed 87 on the side. Must be nice, bro, because I do not get this stuff from this pack. So, Chris McHugh, you are king of the team of the week pack for the week and episode. Love to see the 95 master. Legend Elite. Honestly, no. I was going to say something. No, I'm not going to put it. I'm going to put it right here. <laughs> I think that, you know... I think this pack is better than all, well, not the game days, but it's better than um, the team of the week pack for sure. But it's just another pack where it's like, it's 100K. I just don't feel the need to pull a 100K pack right now. If that pack was like 75K, there we might have a different story. But 100K to me is just too much for a coin pack. You guys know I don't like these packs. But let's get into your elite legend submissions for the week. All right, man, we got some submissions right here. I almost missed this when I was looking at this. I didn't see the 93 overall in the corner of Jay's submission. So you had a 93, 89, 86 dub pack right there. And Chris McHugh, 92 Luke Keekly, and a few other elites on the side. So again, both of those packs, you're making your coins in a little bit, some more. But it's just, I don't know, man. I just feel like you could rip these and just get burnt very easily on a 100K pack. You, base, you need like a 92 overall to break even, so... It's not really for me, but J Ramon713 and Chris McHugh, you guys are King of the Elite Legends pack for the week. And if so, keep on moving. I'm I just haven't pulled this pack a lot. I, I part of me wants to put it here, but the, I'm just gonna put it here because 
do think it's an okay pack it is one of the cheaper packs in the game you know with the pro star i'm gonna rank the pro elite as well i'll put the pro elite obviously above i was actually just ripping the pro elite i really do like the pro elite still i don't know if it compares to the pro star right now but i still like the pro elite i still think it's a good pack so let's get into submissions for the elite and the pro elite and a 94 overall team of the week, man. Pit 2177 right there with a big banger from an elite pack. Don't really usually see many elite submissions nowadays. I might have to mess around with these this week, see what's up with them. But Pit 2177, you are king of the elite pack for the week and episode. Keep on moving. Pro Elite TTD Mullet 674, 95 overall Willie Gay. I mean, big banger alert, bro. But when you're getting a 95 from a coin pack, you just love to see it. I feel like there's a lot of packs I have to mess with this week, guys. And I think Friday, um, before Christmas Eve, if I'm not too busy, I think I'm going to hop on stream and we're just going to burn through all my coins and training into gifts. So I'm going to open up a lot of packs. I think I want to mess around with pro elites, pro stars, might even throw elites into there. We will see. So make sure you guys are there for that. But TTD Mullet614, you are king of the pro elite for the week and episode. Keep on moving. Finals um i think we can get rid of this i have not touched the zero chill 85 plus i don't know if it's good i don't know if it's bad i just personally have not really messed with that pack at all um i'll put it in the garbage just because i i think it's still good especially when um ltds are in there but i just haven't messed with it bro i just feel like there's a lot of other training packs i like to mess with more than that so i'll leave that right there let's get into the submissions for the 85 plus zero chill that's the masters masters are just as good as getting um ltd zero chill guys at this point so seville kaden and aiden free love both with 95 overalls going for i think 450 500k you love to see those popping out seville kaden and aiden free love you guys are king of the 85 plus zero chill training pack for the week and episode hopefully we get a ghost training pack this week i'm not sure how that's gonna work we will see tomorrow or today i should say because i'm recording this tuesday night but star or stars let's go stars stars i haven't i haven't touched stars bro i feel like these are probably better than the elite pack but i also just i haven't touched these i feel like there's coin packs that i mess with and this has kind of fallen off the radar for me but i still do think it's good it's the cheapest one of the cheaper coin packs in the game if you exclude the get a gold so it's it's probably up there but it's it's counterpart has just been so good that i haven't even touched that one so let's get into the star um fantasy submissions for the week then we'll get into the top three did not know that they were hidden like this bells fins mutt and i'm gonna say oxum or i think i don't know if it's autumn one um big banger alert bro almost thought this was the pro star for a second 85 or not 85 95 andre johnson 94 reggie way both big banger pulls from a 27k pack man you love to see that give you all a little bit of a clap right there bells fins mud and awesome or autumn one you guys are king of the star fantasies for the week and the episode love to see that bro i'm gonna have to mess with these i don't know man if they're popping out stuff like that shoot the top packs for me in madden right now the top of the top, the top of the line, the most goaded packs in the game right now. I'm going TVP first. Decent. This, I, I, I'm like, part of me almost wants to put it farther back, but I don't have that much experience with these three packs. But TVP has been off. I don't know. I feel like I haven't been profiting that much. I feel like I'm losing every time I open it. I just don't really know what's going on with it it kind of like worries me because of all the gifts that i'm going to be investing and i wanted to roll that into the tvp but i don't know what i'm going to do bro so let me know what you guys think about the tvp i feel like something is up with it it's definitely having some issues right now but it leads us to the two right here you guys know zero chill was my favorite pack last week it was like i was like talking it up in so much and i did pull an ltd from this pack as well this past week um what i think i'm going to do though is i am going to put the zero chill into the banger and i'm going to put the pro star into the king because if i'm going to be honest with y'all if i was ripping packs off camera it was the pro star into the gifts like i was that's all i was doing like literally the only coin pack i touched until i started to open up the pro elite a little bit um zero chills like they lost their juice that i was you know i had a method i was doing with them the first week and now it's not working as well as it was so um that pack kind of fell off my radar a little bit um maybe i'll mess with it i feel like we'll get an updated zero chill pack maybe with ghost stuff or maybe we just get a ghost coin pack i'm not sure but 
Pro Stars is where it's at, bro. I mean, everybody's been saying that. Everybody's dropping. I think the Pro Stars had almost 20 submissions this week for King of the Pack. So it had to be the King of the Pack, bro. It was just undefeated this week. So let's get into the three submissions. TVP still had four. I almost might have to give the star Pro Stars four as well because they've been getting a lot. But let's get into the submissions, then the top ten. TVP1, we got Delpin84 and Bellisfin and Mutt. I did go with Rasul Douglas because... I feel like he was actually the most expensive. I looked at all the LTDs that came out. Zero chills were at like 430. Like they were just down bad. Um, Marvin Harrison was like 500. Rasul Douglas or Zach Ertz was like nothing. Rasul Douglas was actually going for like 580 when I looked. So I went with the Rasul Douglases. They were also like the first LTDs posted. So went by time and value. So Delpin84 and Bellison Mutt, you guys are king of the TVPs for the week and episode. But we do have a part two part two had to include another rasul um alero 100506 and azn azn uh underscore mr miyagi um ltd palooza right here i think somebody had a rasul douglas but there was no tvp in the corner so i had no clue what pack it was coming from so he didn't get the submission so i went with marvin harrison because he was the next more valuable ltd um big banger pose right here love to see the ltds trying to think i did get it okay i got ltds from the tvp it was the team of the weeks because i was like and the zero chill i was like did i get an ltd last week but yeah i pulled 5.8 million into this pack so i had to get one so um just didn't get the marvin harrison but alero 100 and 506 and azn underscore mr miyagi you guys are king of the tvp packs as well for the week and episode let's get into the next pack that's crazy snow games 04 double masters double 95s I mean, that's like a nine. It's almost a milli, milli pack right there. Depending on how much Debo went for, it actually might be a milli. And then Delpin84 with the LTD. I got the same LTD. So GG to you, man. Um, but so games 04 and Delpin84, you guys are king of the zero chill packs for the week and episode. Keep up the big banger submissions. Let's get to the pro star. Both of these guys are going for a check. I think both these guys are 600K plus. So you know we had to go with them. Gaming, JJH, and AZN underscore Mr. Miyagi, both with 95 legends right there. You love to see it. I think Tony G might have been going for like 650, 700. I'm not sure. All I know is they were both big banger pulls, and you love to see them. Gaming, JJ, er, Gaming JJH, and AZN underscore Mr. Miyagi, you guys are king of the pro stars for the week and episode. Let's get to the top 10. Not much has changed here. Chris went up um, to the nine spot. And I think that's all the changes we really had in the six through 10. Let's get to the top five. There's been a lot of people in the top five that haven't been making submissions, man. Again, this is your time. If you are trying to make a comeback, this is your chance. Delpin is still making submissions. He's taken a you know a pretty firm lead here at 28. But Hawks Nation and Admir, I don't think we've seen a submission in a little while. Snow Games is at 15. Jay is at 15. I mean, dude, this is your time, guys. If you want to make your submissions, make your comeback. We still have many, many more weeks to come, and you never know what's going to happen. So make sure you guys are getting your submissions in, getting them big banger pulls, but let's get back to the tier list. So this is what my tier list looks like. Again, there's a lot of packs that I don't pull. Um, Elite Legend, Team of the Week. I just don't pull them, bro. I just feel like they're just not worth it. The one time I just gave the Team of the Week a chance, it was horrible. Um... And then the other packs, you guys know I usually go king through decent is usually packs that I would say you can pull. They always are making the shape of an L. Um, it is what it is. But I feel like these are pullable packs right now. These two I'm kind of just hesitant on. Not really a pack that I'll be pulling myself. But all these packs I will probably pull in the stream on Friday. So make sure you guys are there. We'll just be burning through my coining, burning through my training, trying to get some gifts up because Christmas Eve and Christmas Day I probably will be busy. So that's just kind of what we're going to do. But that's going to be all for the video. So make sure you guys hit the like button, hit the sub button, put on post notifications, drop down below what is your king pack. And if there was anything on the tier list, you guys would change personally. But I will see y'all in the next video or stream. We will have ghosts. We will have craziness. I think this video will be releasing after the ghost release. So hopefully it was a good one. And hopefully it makes zero chill, you know, end off with a good bang. But I'll see you guys in the next video or stream, man. It has been real. Peace.